first semifinal is Josh Alexander against the Ugandan giant Kamala. Interesting match. Stu, who you got? I'm going to go Josh Alexander. Kamala is going to fall to a smaller guy. And Josh Alexander is too, too technically proficient to not win this one. So I'm going to go Josh Alexander. He ain't that small either, so I agree with you. Josh Alexander, he's the perfect baby face. And then Kamala's going to get tired now. It's a tournament. And it's the third match. Yeah, he's, he's exhausted at this point. And Josh Alexander has the cardio and the perseverance to uh, overcome the odds when it comes to Kamala. Uh, so, yeah, Josh Alexander advances. Agreed. Kamala got lucky getting the two cruiserweights cruiser yeah. along the way, but, uh, but yeah. now he runs into the walking weapon. Yeah, the walking weapon. Alexander I, ain't no cruiserweight. I think Josh Alexander would probably get that match over fairly quickly. So right. Josh Alexander to the final on that one. On the other side of the bracket, two guys that know each other pretty well, Kurt Angle and JBL in a semifinal here. Oh, man, there's a lot of possibilities on this. And Jay. Who are you taking through, or is it going to be the te- the big Texan, or is it going to be the Olympic hero? Well, I'm I'm a, I'm a man of the people, so I'm going to set up the ultimate dream match that everybody would like to see in this scenario. So with Josh Alexander advancing on the other side, let's go ahead and put Kurt Angle. Kurt Angle advances, uh, gets past JBL with the help of his own uh, team Angle, his own his own uh, fruition. Like I said, now he used team Angle the first round. This time. He's using Mark Jindrak and Luther Reigns to hate him <laughs> <laughs> to get to the next round. He just brought everybody <laughs> through the time warp. Yeah, yeah. I got I got oh I, so I got angle. So I want to see that big dream uh, match. Okay. Kurt Angle versus the walking weapon, Josh Alexander. Kurt oh angle my advances. god. JBL's got some friends too, Stu. Does he? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Actually, JBL and I have some have a have a commonality. We both work with the same play by play guy. Uh. Uh, there's a there's a guy that I work with in radio named Lincoln Rose. He is the current radio voice for Austin FC in Major League Soccer. But he worked with JBL uh, calling Abilene Christian games, and I work with Lincoln calling uh, basketball and football. So, oh wow! So this means you're choosing who? Uh, I'm a, I'm gonna choose uh, Kurt Angle. But, okay, you know, okay, yeah. all right. Because the way you would allude to that connection, oh, yeah. Oh, oh, shit. yeah. But yeah, but you know. <laughs> You know, Layfield, give him a good test. Oh, hell yeah. He'll have the, but yeah, I think Kurt Angle will get through. Yep. I also selected Kurt Angle as well. There we go. Good duel. I mean, the, these, those guys battled it out for a while, but, yeah. but, you know, when you're looking through this tournament, you know, this is a pretty fun final right here. And I, I saw this one coming a while ago. And I, I think that's, and that was the one when I drew this up. That was my final right here. It is. Josh Alexander against Kurt Angle, and what a, an amazing match this would be, no doubt about it. Uh, NJ Holiday, the walking weapon against the Olympic hero for the first ever Time Machine Tournament Championship, and then they all get to go home. NJ, who is your winner of this tournament? All right, Stu, let's go ahead and wind the clock back. Let's go ahead and set it up. Let's go ahead and uh, pick the place, uh, Bound for Glory. Let's go ahead and pick the time machine of both eras, both of them in their prime. Let's say this is Josh Alexander from 2021, or was it 22 when he had the belt? Yeah, somewhere in that ballpark, but yeah. So we're going to say Josh Alexander from 2022. And then we're going to put the Kurt Angle from 2007, the one that had all the belts. So the one that had the X Division title, <laughs> the tag team title, and the TNA title. Um, man, this is going to be a hell of a 45-minute <laughs> classic. I would just say with the way that it goes, ankle lock for ankle lock, move for move. I'm going to say, man. Tough one, tough call here. Yeah, it is. The I'm I'm picturing it as it as it as it's happening. Uh, towards the end, how would you want the finish to be? I would just go ahead and say, here it comes, and Jay Holiday. I'm Can't, gonna go. With, he, I'm I'm gonna have to go with the Olympian Kurt Angle. Yeah, he outsmarts Josh Alexander. Uh, not basically he can get him with like I've seen him do this before. He's win a match. Uh, this is a man that. 
is one of the best amateur wrestlers ever grace the squared circle. So with the walking weapon, I feel like they go move for move and they're both busted open, but it's some kind of special, unique pin that Kurt gets them in. Uh, I don't know if you remember uh, Kurt Angle, John Cena, 2002, John Cena's first match. And John was giving him everything that he could handle. And then to the point where Kurt had to get him in that weird, like, cradle pin and got the one, two, three. I'm going to say that's the same scenario here. Uh, he can't beat him decisively. can't make him tap out. He can't knock him out decisively for one, two, three. Uh, this match goes to the freaking wire and Kurt just outwits him with a ring technician or a nice little special pin. He's the one, two, three over the walking weapon. Stu Myrick, we got Josh Alexander and Kurt Angle. Who is your winner? It's going to go the full 60. Yeah. In fact, Josh will have a pin attempt. Referee hand hits two and then time limit. Yeah. Oh, like oh he's That's calling it. Oh, wait. Draw. Oh, wait. Kurt Angle, Josh Alexander, they can't believe it. They're going, hold on. We got to have it. finish this. And they're begging for five more minutes. And the crowd's oh. begging for five more minutes. And Scott Demore comes out and he says, you know what? <laughs> Let's give him five more minutes. Yeah, I like that. And then Kurt Angle wins. Got you. Wow. I will also take Kurt Angle. But boy, it's a th that match would be so much fun to watch. Hell yeah. I mean, those guys and I and I agree, Stu, both of you, that match would be a long, exciting, fantastic match. But yes, I will have to also go with the Olympic hero. So guess what, everybody? The first ever winner of our Pro Wrestling Time Machine Tournament is none other than Kurt Angle. Congratulations, Kurt! You're our winner, man. Yay. Way to go! But you know a lot of but a lot of different ways this could have gone too, guys. I mean, that's part of the fun of of how this works, and you know, with the the random the random draws as well. I mean, some pretty crazy uh, crazy first round matchups, but yeah, so Kurt Angle, way to go, Kurt. You're you're our first big winner. Unbelievable. There so there it is. That is the Pro Wrestling Time Machine Tournament. We'll be doing that every once in a while. Should be, uh, I, th I think people are going to get a kick out of it. So nice booking, guys. Hi, Pro Wrestling fans. Mark Hope here. I'd really appreciate it if you would take a moment to join the Mark Hope Show family. And please click on the subscribe button below. Also, please stick around and check out the incredible sponsor of this video. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you again on the Mark Hoke Show YouTube channel. Looking for high-quality custom screen printing in Las Vegas? Look no further than Off-Grid Creations. Need a few custom t-shirts for a local event, band merchandise, or family reunion? We've got you covered. Large order of uniforms for your staff, sports team, or club? We can handle that, too. Our experienced team will work closely with you throughout the entire process from design consultation to final product. Call us at 661-300-1115. That's 661-300-1115. Or visit our website at off-gridcreations.com. Get a free consult. Consultation today.